this video today I will show you step by step how I make my banana cake it's delicious and we just need few ingredients come with me hey guys I'm Sibel and welcome to my channel so let's get started before make the banana cake let's make the caramel we will need a small pan, water and a cup of sugar. I will show you step by step how to make the caramel and first let's melt the sugar. Don't take your eyes off the caramel otherwise it will burn. When the sugar is all melted we will put the water and we will think everything went wrong but no everything is going perfect. Continue the mix and the caramel is ready. Before start to make the banana cake, remember to turn on the oven to heat it up. For our banana cake we will need sugar, cinnamon, oil, baking powder, eggs. For this recipe we need ripe bananas and flour. Did you know that banana peel is rich in antioxidants and minerals such as potassium and calcium? Yes! And we won't throw it away, we will use them in our banana cake recipe. Let's peel the bananas and put everything in a blender. Before peeling, don't forget to wash the banana. If you don't have a blender, mash one banana with a fork instead of the banana peels. Also, we will add the eggs, the oil. For this recipe, it's much better the vegetable oil. For this recipe, I use half cup of almond milk and it's optional, but if you have it at home, just try it. You will love it. Let's turn on the blender and shake everything. This is the result and I will tell you something, banana and cinnamon, it's a perfect combination. Leave in the comments if you agree. If you don't agree, leave in the comments what is your perfect flavor combination. After adding a tablespoon of cinnamon, we will add one cup of granulated sugar and shake everything again. Despite the banana having been changing its flavor, it still remains a very versatile fruit. So this is the last step of our delicious cake. I like to sift the flour because avoid having lumps of dry flour on the cake. Before putting the baking powder, we will mix everything. For that we will use a big bowl because we don't want to shake the flour too much otherwise it will activate the gluten if that happened our cake will be hard and deformed we don't want that mm, wow okay let's put the baking powder and finish this banana cake recipe because i know you can't wait to try it the cake is ready so now let's cut the banana to put it in our cake pan to be honest upside down banana cake it's always delicious I'm using this cake pan, but you can use the one we have at home. Guys, if you are enjoying this video, don't forget to subscribe, leave your like, because your like is very important to support my channel, and activate the bell to receive notification of my videos. And this is the magic part. Let's put the caramel, the banana, and the butter, and the butter. Batter. And a batter. <sighs> Finally. <laughs> and bring the cake to the oven. Voila! Está pronto! To unmold the cake, use a small metal spatula or a knife to dislodge any cake that may have stuck to the side of the pan. Nothing better than a delicious homemade cake. Our banana cake, it's fluffy, moist, beautiful, fragrant and delicious. Try to make this banana cake recipe. Tell me in the comments if you liked it. I hope you enjoyed this video today and if you liked it, just leave your like, subscribe, activate the bell and see you next video. Ciao! I hope you enjoyed this step-by-step -step that I showed you how I make my banana cake. Enjoy this upside down banana cake with caramel. Leave your like, subscribe, subscribe. No, that's not great.